she's great. She's great because she's so terrible at this, you know. And I and I know, and I don't blame her for the fact that she can't she can't answer any of the questions. Um, she just has to obfuscate all the time. I don't blame her for that. That's what White House press secretaries do. That is their job. Is to their job is to never answer a question. But you, there, there's a skill. There's actually a talent. There's a there's a talent involved in um, being a really good BS artist and uh, being asked a question and giving something that sounds like an answer but isn't, she does not have that skill. Uh, it is so obvious when she's, when she's, we can't even say she's dancing around. This is not dancing. Because dancing gives the impression of someone who's artful and graceful, which she is not. So she has no answer to that. Well, what I can speak to is what the president has said. What I can speak to is his record. What I can speak to is the president. What I can, she keeps listening what she can speak to, and she doesn't speak to it. She doesn't say anything about it. Um, so, that's a good stuff. I mean, in, in fairness, though, it, is, it was a really, really dumb question. Dumb question not only because the person claimed that gun violence only happens in the United States, and dumb not, not only because the person making that claim is from Africa, um, where there is certainly uh, plenty of violence of all kinds, but also done because it all led to the question, what can we do in our individual in our communities to stop gun violence? Well, there's one thing we can do. Like one thing we can all do is, um, maybe, that, maybe that part of the question isn't so dumb. Because actually there is something that we can do in our communities. The two things actually. If you don't want crimes with guns to be committed, one thing is don't commit those crimes yourself. So the more people who commit to that, the less crime there will be. And uh, then the second thing is to have the 